Hey everyone, in this video we will discuss a math olympiad problem which is based on number theory. The question is let n be a positive integer such that n square plus 19 n plus 48 is a perfect square. Then find the value of n. So we have n square plus 19 n plus 48 which is a perfect square. So let's say this is m square. Now since n is a positive integer so this would also be positive so this would also be a square of positive number so now let's try to make it a perfect square n square plus 19 plus 48 so this would be a format 2ab but 19 is not divisible by 2ab right so i will have to make it of like 2 into 19 by 2 into n so this would create of some problems so let's multiply by some number so let's say if i multiply by 2 both sides to 2n square plus 38n plus 96 equal to 2m square now here i will have if i make it a perfect square then this would be 2 into 19 into n but here the problem arises right we will have to make this of root 2 and sort of something like so again the problem persists so we will have to multiply by some other number so let's say if i multiply by 4 so if i multiply we have n square plus 19 n plus 48 equal to m square let's multiply 4 so 4 n square plus 76 n plus 192 equal to 4m square now let's try to make it a perfect square so can i take 2n so this would be 4n square and this would be 2 into 2n so 2a into b so that will be 19 so 2ab plus this would be 19 square so if I'm adding 19 square then I will subtract 19 square plus 192 equal to 4m square. Now I can make a perfect square of this. So 2n plus 19 square minus 361 plus 192 equal to 4m square. From here can I say that 2n plus 19 square. Now if you solve this then you will get nine six one minus one sixty nine equal to four m square now let's take this to lhs so we will get two n plus nineteen square minus four m square now four m square i can write two m whole square right so i can write this as two m whole square and one sixty nine would go to rhs now i can make this a format of a square minus b square so we have 2n plus 19 whole square minus 2m whole square equal to 169 now i can take this as a this as b so i can write this as 2n plus 19 minus 2m so this would be a minus b 2n plus 19 plus 2 and equal to 169 so we got two factors factor one factor two so I will have to factorize this also in two factors. So can I write this as 1 and 169 and 13 and 13, right? This is a square of a prime number. Other than that, we can't split this into two factors. So let's solve them one by one. So we have 2n plus 19 minus 2m equal to 1. 2n plus 19 plus 2m equal to 169. Now if I add them, then we will get 4n plus 38 equal to 170. So 4n would be, to subtract 38, then this would be 132. So from here you will get n equal to 33. Now check what was the condition. So we had a condition that n should be a positive integer. So we got n equal to 33 so we can accept this right and we don't need to find m because this was our 
assume value of m right so we don't have to worry about m so this one is done now let's focus on second one so we have 2n plus 19 minus 2m equal to 13 2n plus 19 plus 2m equal to 13 now if we solve this then we will get if you add them then we will get 4n plus 38 equal to 26 4n equal to minus 12 n equal to minus 3 now this has to be rejected right n can't be negative because this is already given in our question since n has to be greater than 0 so the only one value was possible for n that is 33 so our answer is n equal to 33 so i hope you understood the process we took a parameter m where we assumed that this is a perfect square of let's say m so this expression is equal to m square and then we tried to make this a perfect square we first tried by multiplying 2 then we found that there are some problems here we multiplied by 4 and we found that we were able to make it a perfect square of 2n plus 19 and then we assumed this as then we also converted this to a perfect square of 2m whole square and then we solve further so at last we got n equal to 33 and we found that this case of no use because we found n as negative so this was only our valid case so let's meet in some other video we will discuss some more such high quality questions you can always subscribe to our channel thank you